Hey, this is Brett, and this 2021 Jeep Wrangler Unlimited High Altitude 4xE is stock number 21J228. I'm excited to show you this Wrangler today. We're going to go all the way around it. I'm going to talk a little bit about the 4xE package. You're going to be able to see exactly what that high altitude package brings to the Wrangler. One of the best looking trim levels that Wrangler offers. This color is bright white, and we shoot all of our videos in 1080p, 60 frames per second, so if you have HD capabilities on your computer, tablet, smartphone, or television, I highly recommend turning them on right now, because it is your best way to check out the options, color, looks, and styling of the vehicle before seeing it in person or getting it delivered to your house. So this is a high altitude 4xE. It has the two liter turbocharged four-cylinder engine which combines with the hybrid system to put out 375 horsepower and 470 foot-pounds of instant torque. Once again, bright white is the color. First thing you'll notice on the high altitude package is all the gloss black um, inserts on the grill and around the headlight bezels. It also has the LED running lights, headlights, and fog lights. Color match fenders, color matched hard top as well. This is where you plug in your electric charger on a 240 volt, it'll take 2.4 hours. And on a 120 volt, it'll take roughly 12 hours. Notice you get all the blue trimmed Jeep logo, trail rated logo and Wrangler Unlimited sticker there. The high altitude package also gives you the 20 inch gloss black painted alloy rims and it has Bridgestone Dueler 275-55R20 tires. We'll take a look under the hood here. So you, there's not much to see other than the, that it's a two liter and there's just an orange cord that you can see part of the electric system. But we'll show it anyways. There's that orange cord I was telling you about. Um, once again, 375 horsepower, 470 foot pounds of instant torque. Gets up and goes. Um, so that's the engine bay, not too much special under there. Notice that you do get the blue tow hooks on the painted bumper as well. As far as little Easter eggs, they have the sandals on that plastic shroud there, the Jeep climbing up the window, T50 on the door hinges to let you know exactly which Torx wrench to use to get those off. Here's the original window sticker. Feel free to pause this at any point. I'm not gonna go through everything, but most of it. Unlimited high altitude four by E, two liter dual overhead cam I4 turbo engine, eight speed automatic transmission. Jeep Wave membership is included on this vehicle. Everything on your left is standard equipment, so you do get the 8.4 with the premium audio, Alpine uh, system, battery charge indicator, uh, 373 rear axle, park view camera, and all that good stuff. Uh, Universal garage door is standard as well. The nav is standard. Apple CarPlay, Google Android Auto, uh, Traffic Plus traveling for five years in a six month Sirius XM subscription. Uh, ambient LED interior lighting, leather wrapped steering wheel, steering wheel mounted audio controls. Uh, black Sunrider soft top is not included on this because it does have the three piece uh, body colored hard top. So the 29N package is the high altitude 4xE package, is a $5,575 option. And everything on there is what you get with that. Cold weather group is $9.95. Gives you the heated seats and remote start. Also gives you the heated steering wheel. I don't know why they don't put that on the window sticker, but it does give you the heated steering wheel as well. Advanced safety group gives you automatic high beam headlamp control, full speed forward collision warning plus, adaptive cruise control, and advanced brake assist. Uh, that's $7.95. Anti-spin differential is $5.95 and integrated off-road camera, which was on the front, is $5.95 as well. We'll check that out in just a second. Total MSRP is $61,675. If you want to get your summit price with all the rebates and incentives on this Wrangler in the upper right-hand part of the screen is a link to our website. Click that and check, get your summit price right now. 
Five years, 60 powertrain, so that's your engine and transmission that's going to have that warranty on there. 10 year, 100,000 mile on the hybrid system, as well as the high voltage battery. So you get 10 years, 100,000 miles on those components. Three year, 36,000 bumper to bumper. And here is your miles per gallon. It's a little bit different than your at normal miles per gallon because they don't really have it um, split into city and highway. Uh, you'll notice that you get 49 MPGE, so 2.4 hours uh, for a 240 volt charge. And we just did a demo. Roughly, you can do about 27 miles with these. Um, it says up to 22 miles, uh, all electric ranges 0 to 21. Um, in the real world drive, we did about 26. So, or at least that's what it said we could do. Now, you're, if you're just going to run the 2.0 engine, you're going to get 20 miles per gallon average. A uh, total of 370 miles capability on this vehicle when you're all charged up and have all the gas in the tank. Your annual fuel cost is uh, about 1700 bucks, and then your greenhouse gas and fuel economy ratings are right there. Um, you can see the CO2s at an 8, 10 is the best, and miles per gallon is 6. Once again, 10 is the best, and small rating is about 5. It's not been ready for a crash test yet, but we'll get into this interior in just a little bit because it is the best looking interior on the Wranglers by far. Um, you get this plastic 3M tape on the front of the wheel wells. Why does it matter? Because when, you're, uh, when you have the painted wheel wells, you get rock chips, rocks bounce up on here, and you can see them on the used. They're, they're all pitted and sandblasted, but it's nice having that plastic guard right there. The color match hard top is a really good look on this vehicle. Get the matching spare tire and HD backup camera. They put this plastic shroud on the bottom of the tires now so it doesn't leak onto your bumper. You used to see these with stains all over the bumpers and so now they got that guard there which is nice. You get the blue tow hook back here, the LED license plate light, backup parking sensors, the 4 by e logo, that E is actually a metal flake on that paint, it, even behind the 4 and the X, so I just thought that's kind of cool. You also get the LED tail lamps. Back storage area. All the 4 by es are going to come with a charger, so you can charge it at your house with just a normal 120 volt, and then this plugs right in. You use this to charge it. And it'll let you know when it's all charged up. Uh, so that's pretty nice that it comes with that. Also comes with a bag for that charging cord. You do get storage underneath here. You have door hinge holder, roof, and windshield bolt holders back here. Alpine premium sound system. And to get this hard top off, there's three bolts on the each side, two on the top, and then two quick disconnects. I actually got a video on how to take your hard top off. If you want to check that out, it's in the upper right hand part of the screen. You'll notice that all the bars are painted to match the outside of the vehicle. You also get this JL badge on the back here, which gives you wheelbase overall length and water fording, as well as a couple other little facts about the Wrangler. Color match fuel door. You get the step bars with this package as well. Basically, this is a Sahara. And then you get the high altitude on top of that. Uh, heated mirrors, built-in blind spot monitoring, enter and go system. And this is the best interior, in my opinion. On the Wranglers, you get the quilted stitching on the seats, the nice soft leather really a good look it's the copper stitching uh, seat height adjuster lumbar factory floor mats auto headlamps here is your hybrid electric and e-save modes so you get three different modes that you can drive in when and we did the real world demo of driving a an electric um, rubicon around if you want to check out that video it's in the upper right hand part of the screen uh, you get your power locks power mirrors in here We'll hop inside, take note of that steering wheel. That's all copper stitched as well. It's heated, adaptive cruise control, cruise controls, 
Bluetooth information center controls, audio controls. Um, we'll turn the ignition on. You can check out that seven inch LCD display. Get the little Wrangler animation at the beginning. Um, so this right here is how much battery we have charged and then your miles that you can go on just electric. So right now we don't have it charged up, so it's at zero. Uh, when we had it all charged up uh, on our test drive, it was at about 26, 27, and that was at 98%. On the left here, you have your tack for the engine, and then on the right, you have um, your charge and then your percent of power that you're using for the electric there as well. Uh, so that's pretty cool. Notice you get the leather wrapped dash on here. It has the 8.44C radio with the factory navigation system. It does have AM, FM, and Sirius, like we talked about, the traffic and travel link service for five years, the six month Sirius XM subscription for uh, six months. You also have your heated seats and heated steering wheel here. And then your backup camera, you can check out that at pretty much any time. And that's HD, that's super crystal clear. Um, those grid lines are dynamic, so you can see they turn as you turn that steering wheel. And then you have the forward-facing camera, which gives you a view out the front. And you can, as you turn that steering wheel, those lines are dynamic too to kind of give you an idea of where you're going to be going, if, especially if you're off-roading or stuff. You know, don't want to drive over right on logs and whatnot. Um, and then you have all your different apps here, including a projection manager where you can project your cell phone to the screen via Android Auto or Apple CarPlay. We actually did a demo on Android Off. You want to check that out and just how that system works. And then you have your off-road pages here, which are pretty cool as well. They do take a second to load. So while they're loading, I will show you that it does have your climate and audio controls there, your heated seats, heated steering wheel buttons, um, stability control, mute, parking sensors, your crawl control, and you turn, can turn that screen off, window controls, and then you get a USB AUX and USB-C jack. So it also has this little blue button here with a battery with circles around it so what that does when it's on when that blue light is on it's in max regeneration mode which means that it's going to use all the brakes and all the slowdown and momentum of the vehicle to charge the batteries while you're driving so you can turn that on to get a little bit more life out of the batteries um, so that you don't just eat them up completely right away so that's kind of a cool system but it, you can, it's definitely noticeable when that is on, like the, the vehicle slows down a lot faster and it uh, brakes a lot different than when it's off. Right here you have your off-road pages with the drivetrain, your steering angle. Um, notice as I turn that steering wheel, once again, those angles change. You get your accessory gauges right here. Um, coolant, oil temp, battery voltage, trans temp, oil pressure, and then your uh, pitch and roll. Also latitude, longitude, and altitude are on there as well. And then you can switch it to the trail camera on here as well. So that's pretty cool. And then you can go to there. So you can jump around the radio. It's pretty cool. You get that copper stitching on the dash and the top part of the dash as well. And then you get your quick disconnects up there, SOS and assist buttons, auto dimming mirror, and your home link buttons for your garage door security systems and lane systems. And if you notice those um, lines right there, there's seven of them, just like the grill. Kind of neat. So what we'll do is I will show you the back seats. And there is a significant difference on the back seats from a hybrid model to a non-hybrid mod model. This is your case for your soft top. We'll just put that, or your hard top pieces, I should say, the front hard top pieces. We'll just put that in back at the second. So the biggest difference is that in a normal Wrangler with just gas, these seats fold up and then they fold down completely flat. Um, actually, these don't fold up at all. They just, the whole seat just kind of folds down completely flat. Now in a four by E, this is where the batteries are. So. You can't put that seat all the way down flat. These seats come down like this. You can see that it does, it is raised up from the back, so it's not completely flat with the black, with the back. Um, and that is the biggest thing on the, as far as the interior differences from a four by E to a normal Wrangler is that those seats don't go completely flat. 
you do get two USBs, two USB-Cs, and then another 115 volt, or a just one 115 volt, 150 watt plug-in. You do get child safety locks on the back doors. And we'll take one more final walk around with all the LED lights on here. And I would personally like to thank you for checking out the video today and hopefully from this HD video, you'll have gotten a really good idea of the overall looks and styling and options on this particular Wrangler. And uh, learned a little bit about the 4xE package. And that is a really good looking front end on a Wrangler. And to see more pictures of this Jeep or one of our other 450 new and used cars, trucks, SUVs, minivans, Wranglers, you name it, we gotta go to that website right there www.summitauto.com full pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle from two locations all at summitauto.com and if you'd like to check out more HD videos you can go to youtube.com slash summitauto remember to like subscribe and share on this video and all the videos that you see there click the bell notifications so you'll get updates on the videos we do each and every day here at summit auto in fact in a second you will see a link to subscribe to our youtube channel in the upper left link to more Wrangler videos like this one in the upper right a link to this vehicle on our website in the lower left and a link to one of our latest youtube videos in the lower right click those check us out and we're super excited to be offering the jeep Wrangler lineup and the Jeep lineup in general and uh, especially this 2021 Jeep Wrangler unlimited high altitude in bright white clear coat with the 4xE package. Thanks again for checking out the video. Remember to like, subscribe and share.